You thought we were done with one game, didn't you? It never ends. <laughs> it does not end. I guess Crystal Princess was so successful they brought Webfoot back two years later to make another game. Did they make Gen 4 games? Or is it just, uh, like... They made a mobile game. Oh, okay. And there's plenty of fan games, of course. What? You turn Including... the music down? <laughs> I can just mute the entire game if I want. <laughs> Gotta go in raw. Can you believe I don't have a save file for this game? Mm, no, tough to believe. Hello, Cheerly. I feel like she looks different from the last game, but I don't yeah. care enough to know. See, because yeah, G3 wasn't a consistent story. It was just a bunch of like direct-to-DVD episodes and specials, so they didn't have to stay consistent. Sweetie Bell. I kind of hate some of their names. Let's see, Sweetie, Sweetie Belle I'm okay with, because she comes back. In Gen 4? Yeah, and this game has voice acting. Oh, voice Whoa. acting. Whoa! The true power of the <laughs> Nintendo Sweet. DS. You see, this this isn't fun. Unlike uh, other DS games with the voice acting I've played, it's not horribly bit-crushed, so it's not nearly as fun. How funny would it be if one of them just had, like, a really deep masculine voice? Nobody mentioned it. Yeah, it'd be that uh, deep voice Fluttersh I had uh, <laughs> under the effects of Poison Joke. <laughs> exactly. So I just want to make uh, bring something up here. Actually, a couple things regarding... That's another one. Oh, those little visual glitches you're going to see throughout the video. I don't know what the problem is. Something in the rendering process caused it. I don't think it's major enough to worry about. Okay, so it's not an issue with the game itself. Nah. In the okay. emulator, it ran fine. These flags, these flags, it's just like, they didn't even put the yellow on the bottom ones. It's just flat out, like... I didn't, re I didn't realize it, but I think that last place was a partially redrawn Ponyville Square. Which, actually, you know what? We're in Ponyville. You know what? That's fair. Never mind. Uh, so, second technical thing to bring up. I don't know what the hell the problem was when I did my review, but this game did not work. Now it works fine. And finally, uh, my movement. I'm only going to be moving in four directions, because I could not get the emulator to recognize diagonal movements, because you have to map them separately, but with the keyboard it would not accept two buttons simultaneously. Hmm. So diagonals are impossible. What emulator were you using for this? A uh, desk move. Hmm. It should work, but then again, I don't think I've ever played a game that uses diagonal movement. There's more of that quality two walk, two button walk, two foot, two foot walk. That's what I meant to say. Yeah, it looks, looks great. This time with beautiful HD DS graphics. Yeah. By the way, I hit the B button. I was supposed to hit A, hitting B quits the minigame. Okay. Yeah, not crazy. So this is the plot of the, of the game. It's Pinkie Pie's birthday, uh, but Sweetie Belle hid all of our presents across Ponyville when she was supposed to hide them in the square. So uh, it's our job as the birthday girl to find all our presents. That seems like a bad... Like, Sweetie Belle, come on. And the best part is, like, throughout the game, when we talk to her, she'll be like, yeah, you're... Aside from the fact that... You know what? There's multiple things wrong with this. The fact is, some of the ponies have the presents, because we complete these minigames and we get presents for... as a reward. And then sometimes the other ponies know where they're hidden, because they'll tell us... That's debatable. I really don't like watching them walk on two legs, dude. But, uh... They'll tell us where to find other presents. But it's still our job to do it. It's like <laughs> Mario. It's like Mario Sunshine. You gotta earn your birthday gifts. Yeah, I know that this. I know that this town will cease to exist without the power of the Shine Sprites, and that I'm the only person capable of finding them. But I gotta find fruit for this guy.
And there's also puzzle pieces to find. I just I see not, the bugs and like I've been playing Animal Crossing like all that day name. and I'm like, I'll oh, catch that, Emma. Scottaloo certainly is a name. The little worms are just kind of like watching you do everything. It's a little unnerving. I, these guys have very low standards. <laughs> You know, don't I have a birthday party that we're supposed to be attending? Look what are we man, all doing here? Scootaloo. Scootaloo was in Gen 4. She was, like, yep. young, though, right? She was, like, a yes. kid. Same with Sweetie Belle. Oh, that's right. And in the in this continuity, Scootaloo and Sweetie Belle already have their cutie marks, so uh, that's about half of half the show's worth of character arc uh, <laughs> taken care of. I was going back through a bunch of my old Word documents and found the uh, My Little Pony OC we had going. Oh, David. If you Ford. could delete that, <laughs> mine's only like two reminded. paragraphs, so I'm not gonna do anything with it. Obviously, just reminded of Davenport. I think that was his name. Yeah. So if you guys ever wanted to know how I got my start in fan fiction, uh, there you go. I'm, <laughs> I'm still audience. I'm still not ago. telling you where to find the rest of it. That must have been. I mean, not when I was in high school. I don't think early college. When did this? When did Gen Four start? Uh, it started late 2010, so uh, it'll be hitting its 10 year anniversary soon. Oh my God! It has been that long. Oh, so it wasn't when I was in high school. Yeah. Good God. I remember doing My Little Pony uh, Let's Play over in, in college. I used a Guitar Hero mic plugged into my computer because my computer mic didn't work anymore. Yeah. Good time. My Guitar Hero mic. Uh, well, yeah. I gave it back, I think. I don't think so. I don't uh, think maybe I not. It. Well, we don't play Guitar Hero anymore, so. Yeah. But listen, I still have that drum kit sitting over there. Mostly because it's impossible to get rid of that stuff now. Yeah, I mean, who would want that? The bubble burst on that long ago. Do they still make those? Guitar nope, they, they tried a couple years ago, and hmm. both Guitar Hero Live and Rock Band 4 failed. Which, on Rock Band 4's side, is a slight shame, because they had a Proto Man song in that game. Really? Yeah, oh. they had Light Up the Night, which is like their best song, so. That was that was the one I saw with you, right? Yep. Proto Man? Yeah. That's a good show. Maybe, maybe someday they'll release Act 3. Oh, speaking of Guitar Hero. I'm a master. Oh, officially a master, huh? Rhythm Heaven it... wishes it could be this good. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm not doing what I did in the Sonic Generations LP and just resyncing this to Rhythm Heaven music. <laughs> that took forever. I'm not doing that again. Sounds great. <laughs> Do you know Freebird? <laughs> anyway, here's Wonderwall. <laughs> He's sad Can you imagine you just being a pony or whatever and hearing your friend just play this on the <laughs> chimes or whatever? Like, come on! Better than uh, hearing this pony play the holophoner. <laughs> yeah, good point. You don't think Pinkie Pie is a holophoner master? Star song. Honestly, I'm surprised. I'm not doing great here, but I'm surprised how relatively well I can draw circles with a mouse. It looks like Star Song is playing the uh holophone right now. Yeah, that's why I brought it up. Ah. Or a bong. The other thing it looks like. I yeah, suppose. These, these circles are pretty good. I'll be an artist yet. <laughs> Yo, 
Yeah, this is Man. a jam. Go off, Star Song. Yeah, talk to each pony several times, because uh, they might have a new mini game or a hint on where to go. Oh, they got you 20 presents. That's pretty nice of them. Thankfully, the map on the top screen is always there to tell you where to go next. And it means where to go next, because when it comes to the presents, those do not appear until someone tells you about them. You can click Sh on things, by the way. Schrodinger's birthday gift, I guess. Oh, nice cake. You see, I seem to recall that we were in Scootaloo's treehouse, but I guess there's something there now. Yeah, I'm sure I'm doing a great job. <laughs> Yeah, so we're talking about names. How do you feel about Tula Rula? I don't like the Tula what? Rula. Tula Rula. <laughs> so we're already down to uh, 11 of the 12 puzzle pieces. Not bad. Only 11 gifts, though. I'm keeping it even. That's fair. For a brief second there, we walked through Green Grove Zone. I, I should have edited that. Every time we walked through there, I should have put in Green, green Grove Zone. Imagine if uh, you just, like, walk past some of these shops in the, like, in beautiful little Ponyville or whatever, and you just walk past an Arby's. <laughs> <laughs> There's got to be some weird product, like, tie-in somewhere in My Little Pony that I can't think of, like, in terms of marketing. There must be. I'm sure it's not going to be anywhere near as exciting as Hatsune Miku and Domino's. I mean, that's A+. Plus. <sighs> they give you a very generous time limit on this one. They really do. They're like, do you want to play this for three straight minutes? Like, no? I understand that I'd be doing better if I was on an actual DS, but even regardless, I still complete this within one minute. Speedrun. Even with three failed circles in a row. I don't know how exact you have to be, but it seems like you gotta get at least most of the butterfly in your circle. Woohoo! Well done. I like that they tell you that was fun. Like, yeah. you might have not have decided that on your own. <laughs> they have to reassure you. They're like, no, 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 you thought it was fun, don't worry. The game's gaslighting you. <laughs> yeah, really. It took me a s- I didn't really read the instructions, it took me a minute to realize what you were supposed to do in this minigame. I thought you were supposed to feed the gophers for a little bit. Oh, so you did it's, a bad job. Yeah, no, it's like, no, you have to specifically put it in the hole when there isn't a gopher there. So I was basically doing the exact wrong thing. But you were feeding the gophers, which I thought was nice. Thankfully, there's no time limit and no limit on the number of seeds we have. Oh, I see you figured it out now. Yeah. And, uh, since the gophers aren't coming back out once we put a flower in, I assume they're trapped down down in their holes. They are. They become they're the so, flower. They're so, so hungry. Oh, God, that's dark. <laughs> Toodles. Oh, no. Just Toodles is in goodbye, not Toodles is in a new pony. Yeah, I, I thought that for a brief second, too. <laughs> yeah, the kind of a uh, glitch that comes up over the map just sort of looks like you're in a gated community. <laughs> SCP Pinkie Pie. Keep a close eye on it, everybody. I already lost it. I'm gone. <laughs> I don't know which one it is. Oh, good news. It's the exact same place it started. Oh, great. <laughs> this oh. thing's very easy. Oh, 
you know, listen, if the rest of you guys help me find the presents, we can get the party done with faster and you can go back to your normal lives. No, they want to waste their whole day making you do this. They're like, we have nothing else planned. And despite the fact that we literally just came from Rainbow Dashes, there's a present in there now. Rainbow Dash just kind of forgot. See, honestly, in a place like this, I could excuse myself for just having missed it. Mm-hmm. Rainbow you know, Dash was hiding it in, they in a sparkle. closet until uh, you came out. Oh, yeah, I found this under the couch. <laughs> right between the cushions. You gotta love that the game gives you the ability to replay any game you've played in case you just can't wait until you're finished with this 20 minute game to play a mini game again. No, I have to play the umbrellas again right now. I mean, as I'll they keep saying, the mini games play. were fun. Oh, yeah, you're right. They were fun. <laughs> they How said could so. I possibly resist? They said they were fun, so. So they must be fun. They must be fun. Imagine if every mini game in any game felt the need to say that. <laughs> <laughs> like you finish a game of Triple Triad in Final Fantasy VIII, and Squall uh, just says, "Ellipses, that was fun." I was trying to think of what many mini games might be in it. Any game I play at all, and I like I don't play any games really so i'm just imagining like minecraft after i build a dirt hut that was like you loved it <laughs> <laughs> every time you complete a mini game in mario party they're like don't question me you liked it okay look at this really for using the power of the ds to its full we have to use the microphone Ooh. It took me a second here, because I had to remember, like, oh shit, what button did I map the microphone to? I'm really lucky that I rem that I just had a microphone set up in my emulator already. So I'm like, okay, hit the V button, and that simulates blowing in the microphone. You have to decorate for your own birthday party, too? Man, these people don't want to give you anything. By the way, you don't have free reign with the decoration either. There's only so much of each stamp. What? Oh. Happy Pinky Y. <laughs> you can at the very least put it outside the banner. Looks good. Oh, okay. <laughs> this looks nice. Birth. <laughs> and uh, how would I rate this game? Oh, well, I can't give it more than two stars. Well, I <laughs> guess it's two stars. All right. And now- Oh, your time to shine. It. Now let's make a cake. Disgusting. And we can only put six candles on the cake, so I guess Pinkie Pie is six years old. They're <laughs> it's up to them how old you are. <laughs> That's a really interesting cluster of candles. <laughs> <laughs> and the one doll of frosting. <laughs> That's a good looking cake. Yum. You positioned it so the wax from the candles drips directly into the one bit of frosting. <laughs> oh, I just posi- I, I only thought about positioning it so Pinkie Pie was on top of the flame. <laughs> they really only do blue, pink, purple, huh? That's their color scheme. Mm -hmm. Yippee, present. We're so close, guys. Only one your present, more present your left. Present is the, maybe the real present is the minigames we got to play along the way. <laughs> <laughs> it's unrelated to the game, but I really like the little bionicle you have on your shoulder in your icon. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I, I have that little guy sitting on my uh, desk right now. I have him on my shoulder in every review. Oh, nice. So I figured when I had this uh, piece drawn four and a half years ago, oh like, yeah, put him on there. Was that long ago? Yeah, man. Is it Viserac? Was that what they were called? Something yep. like that. Yeah, I had a white one years and years ago. 
Now, I just want to bring that up. Sweetie Belle referred to herself in the third person. I actually went online to wikis to try and figure out, like, is that an aspect of her character? Or did they just not write the dialogue with Sweetie Belle saying it in mind? Wow, I, I don't hate, know. I hate that visual. I do not like any of these <laughs> animations. Really they make me bad. feel incredibly uncomfortable. <laughs> oh, uh, good news. We're going to be here for a while. Oh. <laughs> edit, edit. You should have edited caramel dancing over this. Oh, that, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> I actually was listening to that song pretty recently. <laughs> that is pretty much what they're doing. Hamster dancing. I hate this <laughs> so much. Why is this one of the long mini games? Because we have to follow along with five different dances. Oh, I don't know five dances. I can't dance. The good news is you don't have to worry about rhythm. Like, you'll see when I do it, I just go bup, 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 bup. Thank God you do not have to have rhythm. Not to say I couldn't, as someone who has beaten, like, ten songs on Hatsune Miku, Project Eve F Seconds, Expert Difficulty. Oh, brag about it. Hey, to my credit, it's a pretty hard game. I'm pretty good at it. I can't believe Miku got cholera. <laughs> oh no, they're not gonna get that, because that video isn't coming out. Well, it's funny out of context. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think what the funniest song for them to dance to, to this would be. Uh, I didn't bother replacing the song. I could have, I suppose. You love this song. <laughs> it's your favorite song. I love this five second loop. <laughs> I think Piano Man would be pretty funny. Hmm. Well, I, that's my least favorite animation. <laughs> Looks good. <laughs> 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 yeah, bust it up. It was a bit of a struggle trying to find, like, five different video game dances that I could well, think I of off I the top of my head. I have to say, with that edit, they were right. That was fun. Yeah. Don't like... You gotta love Michael Jackson just popping up in the middle. Yeah. Yippee! See, and the Shantae edit was fitting, because since recording this, I've now played through Pirate's Curse, and I'm playing Half Genie Hero again. I'm calling bullshit. That is not the banner I made. That I is not say, the cake you didn't, I made. That, you didn't make this not stuff. your cake. This is not my beautiful cake. This is not my beautiful banner. <laughs> oh. It's fine. The, we're going to go up and do our dance. No, <laughs> okay, thank God. What I really wanted was more dancing. <laughs> really good music choice here. Uh, that this <laughs> this also required some thought. Like, what do I put in? It was perfect. I think you guys did really well. Who was that you were dancing with? I don't know any of their names. Uh, I think that's Star Song. Oh yeah, no, you're right. Oh, we kind of got like pony integration going on here. We got yeah, three we different races. Oh shit, we have a Pegasi. There weren't any Pegasi in the last game. Yeah, we got a Pegasus, a Unicorn, and four, four or five Normals. <laughs> normals. <laughs> normals. <laughs> Sorry, is that insensitive? <laughs> oh, good, you can build a cool puzzle. Don't worry, they give you the solution. Also, it's a four by three grid. You can't mess it up. Aside you from those two middle up. pieces, you can't mess it up. You, you just messed it up right now. It's fine. I'm doing great. And it was fun. It was fun, Pinkie Pie. Thank you. All right. So oh, that, that was my really is just 20 minutes long. <laughs> yeah, that was Pinkie Pie's really part. made the last one. My man found his calling. Mandy, Mandy Pal. That was on the last one. See, I, I want it. I remember. I want to cross-reference these credits with uh, the Legacy of Goku games. I think Sam will play it with the last one as well. So, uh, between the two games, 
Which one do you think is better? This one. This one. Okay. Slightly less boring, although occasionally slightly more awful to look at. <laughs> yeah. See, I'll give the previous game credit that it has you know, a story to it. It did have a story. This one was kind of uh, rude. Is. They're like, I don't know, you do it. It's your birthday. <laughs> Throw your they're own both, party, idiot. They're both a bunch of fetch quests. Yeah. They're both a bu They're basically the same game. This one's just shorter. And that's why it's better. All yeah, right. exactly. <laughs> With more high-quality dance animation. Dallas Wilson, I feel like, was in the... No, it was somebody else Wilson. Oh, Russell Brock definitely was in the last one. Todd every Thomas, yep. Every every time you say Russell Brock for a second, I keep thinking you're going to say Russell Brand. I also think I'm going to say that. <laughs> Lanson A. Eldred. Now, come on. Somebody had to have a middle name in there. Glenn Peters. That was in the last one. There's really just like one My Little Pony lab, huh? Mark Blesher. So that's I'm not giving a salute to all these people. You can't see it, but I am. <laughs> So technically, this isn't the entire game. What? We spent the entire game collecting the presents, mm -hmm. and now we can go open them and play with them. Oh, okay. Whoa. Are we going to do that? Which is good, because uh, that's really the fun part of a birthday party. It's the stuff you actually get. Well, yeah. Be a real tease if they didn't let you have any of that. And you can put the puzzle together again. Well, that was fun. Oh, you're not going to do that again, huh? Even though Pinkie Pie said it was fun? So I got 20 presents to get to. But which one do I want to open first? Hmm. This one looks good. Rub your stylus over your gift. Oh, that's what the kids are calling it nowadays. <laughs> I wonder what this could be. A grenade! <laughs> <laughs> Just a sick world we live in, sick people!